this. Look at this. Um, I had so fun making this and I used so much of my silver pen because I could. Legit reason. Oh, and the gold too to outline, outline this one. Let's see, I'm gonna mess with the exposure. Hey everyone, it's Sarada and I scribble and uh, I just did this whole voiceover without actually recording it so I'm kind of pissed about that but today I am drawing Stardew Valley fan art because I have been <laughs> I've fallen into a hole that I originally got out of and I cannot get out. It is, it is bad. <laughs> oh, it's so bad guys. Um, so when Stardew Valley first came out, I was super into it right away. Like I've never played Harvest Moon or anything like that. And people were comparing it to that a lot, but Farming Sims has always intrigued me. I love Farming Sims and um, I started playing. And I think I sank 120 hours into it that first time, if not more. It was just so fun. And if you like farming simulators with a lot of cute characters and cute graphics and great music, you should really pick it up because it's it's so good. Seriously, it's so good. Um, so when I originally played Stardew Valley and found out you could marry characters, I immediately went searching for the one. And the one turned out be to be Shane who is the most prickly character you can pick, and unfortunately in that first version of the game you could not marry Shane. So I was bummed out and ended up not marrying anyone. I think I was considering Sam or Sebastian. Sam, probably. But uh, I ended up not marrying anyone. So um, then we got the news of an update where Shane and uh, Emily? Was it Emily? Another female character, anyway, sh uh, would become marriageable. Is that even a word? And uh, super hype about that, so I followed the updates. And the update came, but I was distracted by other things like um, art and uh, Mass Effect and things like that. So I just never got around to it. And um, uh, just the other week, I was thinking a lot about Stardew Valley again. And uh, I picked it up. And I have been playing a lot, <laughs> a little more than a lot, too much maybe. I just, I have fallen, fallen back into this massive hole. I, oh god, it's it's so bad. <laughs> so, um, for this video, I I was going to do a completely different t thing. Actually, I was going to do it yesterday. But I played Stardew Valley all day yesterday, and then I was like, no, no, today I have to, I have to sit down and do this video. I'm gonna do it, and then I can play Stardew Valley all evening. It is now evening, and <laughs> I played Stardew Valley all day. It is, it is bad. Um, so I quickly slapped this together because I could not leave Stardew Valley. So I made a Stardew Valley spread in my sketchbook with my main character and or my character. I'm not sure if they call it a main character, but with my character and Shane because I am wooing him. I actually got him to boyfriend status today, which has not happened with any other character in the past 150 hours now, I think. So I'm really happy about that. Um, <clears throat> So, um, it is hard work getting character to, characters to like you, by the way. It is such hard work. I'm probably doing it poorly, but yeah. Um, so I did this spread with doodles and, um, uh, my character is called either Nerine or Nareen. I haven't decided on whether I want to be Wapanese or just pronounce it with a proper western accent? I'm not sure. Either either is fine. I'm okay with either. Um, so I did some doodles. Um, the first two were just sort of portraits and um, the second one was a little tiny comic here where uh, uh, Neri, where Nareen offers beer to Shane and he just sort of takes it and all is well. He is very hard to woo without getting sort of discouraged because he keeps telling you not to talk to him because it doesn't know you and then he gets super happy when you give him stuff he likes like beer or pizza and then he goes back to telling you not to talk to him because 
he doesn't know you. So it's like, dude, why? <laughs> the original reason I fell for Shane too, not only because he's like the prickliest human being in this game, he is so prickly. He just does not want anything to do with you. Um, the the super main reason why I fell for Shane was because he likes chickens. He loves chickens, and I love the chickens in Stardew Valley. Like one of the first fan arts, actually, in a sketchbook tour I showed it. Uh, if you go back to a sketchbook tour that covers May 2016, you will be able to see it there. But the first fan art I did for Stardew Valley was of my character holding all of our chickens. And uh, I just, there are, the chickens in Stardew Valley are so cute. So it was just like, we are a perfect match. Shane and Noreen are a perfect match. It must happen. So I did uh, the red comic uh, on the first page is about uh, just Noreen asking Shane about his favorite animals and he says chickens and she quietly, quietly, quietly mumbles, marry me. Um, and then this one I'm working on right now is based off of one of the uh, canon events. Uh, when you get to four hearts with Shane, you can get this cutscene thing. And I really think that is one of the... Mm, cute ones. A lot of his cutscenes are very, very sad, but um, uh, I like this one. This one is kind of cute. Um, so, yes. Ah, uh, god. I just... Do you play Stardew Valley, by the way? If you played it, or if you're planning on playing it, you sh should really play it. But tell me about your game of Stardew Valley, um, who you romanced, uh, or who you're planning to romance if you haven't gotten that far yet. I just... Uh, Stardew Valley is amazing, and as soon as this video has finished rendering, I am going back to playing Stardew Valley. Um, I never finished the spread <laughs> because I realized when I was doing this last illustration that I was getting very impatient and the quality was veining, and while this is a sketchbook, I don't want it to look all too crappy, so I'm, I stopped. The last one was supposed to be about... Um, uh, my character buying chickens at Maureen's farm and Shane sort of not wanting her to take the tiny chicks because he named them all and it would be super Either cool. way, this video is now over and as I said, I'm gonna play Stardew Valley. So thank you so much for watching. Please do if you haven't, take a moment to subscribe. You can hit that button, join in for more fun art videos. You can also follow me on my social media. Links to those will be down below as well as to my Etsy and my Redbubble store. Check this out if you'd like. Until next time, keep on scribbling friends. Bye!